Hey, thanks for stopping by. My name is Murphy Cargus, and this is Sugar Ray Songs in Order. We are on number seven, and that's Mean Machine. Mean Machine! Mean Machine! My daddy said, son, you're gonna drive in the truck. Turn it on! 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 Mean Machine. Uh, is a special song for, I think, all of us. Um, it was the first single for on Atlantic Records. Um, it was the first song we heard on the radio. Um, it was the first song that got added. It got added to the end in Seattle. Um, and when we heard that, that was just so thrilling and cool. Um, you know, we were added to a real radio station. Um, and then we heard it, it was the first song we heard. We heard it, I think we had, I know, for some reason we didn't hear it out there. We just knew that it was, um, it had been added. But it was really thrilling. We flew to New York for something. I don't know whether it was gigs or press or something. And we heard it in a taxi cab on the radio. And that was, the, that was amazing. I mean, that was the first time I remember we really heard our debut record on the radio in a random taxi in, um, in, uh, in New York City. And so that was thrilling and really cool. And the song itself actually was a riff I wrote. I, I wrote the music to it. Um, and I actually ripped off, I heard it was a Meat Puppets, no, it was a Butthole Surfers. And um, I, it was a song that was really kind of churning and churning and looping. And I'm like, hey, that's rad. I just was inspired by it for some reason. And I came up with, we tuned down to D here. So there's D and drop your, we're actually in A flat. We tune our guitars a half step down. So it dropped the low string down to D and I was going. Sometimes I go to kind of hear that note more. Devil's at 50 but this one's mine. Japanese car man, such a pity. AM radio suits me fine. Mean machine. There's the riff. And then don't you dare mess with don't you dare mess with the mean machine. I would sometimes walk up to that, but that's basically the chorus. Just don't you dare mess with my mean machine. It's long and slick. And that would add that octave right there. But anyway, so that's the tune. It was a song that we actually um, just played for years, and uh, you know, played it all. We never didn't play Mean Machine. It was the first single, and it had a lot of energy. It was fun. And later on, we could actually later on in the song, we would take a section just. We'd start singing like any song over that area, like another rock song, another song on the radio. something we did with that. Fly, we did that too. Um, we would kind of, I mean, it's such a simple, if, if you have a, a chord progression that's really simple, you can really sing like anything over it. So um, that was something that we did in, um, in Mean Machine a lot. And Craig would come out live. And perform and, and, and do like a dual thing with Mark. That's Me Machine. It, it lived a long life. It was a really fun song. Um, hard and fast riff, our first single. I gotta stand up because I, I just I can't sit and play Mean Machine, you know, there's no way. 
Okay, gotta get the stance. And let me say something about the bass stance. The bass player stance when he spreads the legs, you know? Um, I, I don't know that it's looks. You're actually, it's a big, heavy, beefy instrument. The strings are huge. It's not easy to play. You're kind of taking like, you're, you're planting the ground. You ever see like those cranes or those big things that like have huge arms above them? Sometimes they'll have extra giant like steel leg, that they like bolt into the ground. That's a bass player stance. And the reason is we need to lay the foundation to the ground to like play this right and lay the groove. You can shake your, you know what to. So here we go. This song's called Yeah, Mean Machine. It's been a little while. It's been some time since I played that thing. Um, it's fast, man. Halfway through, I'm like, I'm not playing this fast enough. Um, I think I was a little bit behind. Um, I like it. It felt good. I think I played it okay. But it's just, I like being precise if it's a, a riff like that, a song like that. Been out of practice a little bit playing that fast and that simple and that brrr, loopy ratatatty. So, uh. you know, it's funny. I used to use these red picks, and I would look, and I would have all these shreddings of red. It would just like be coated in red flakes. Um, and you know you're doing your job if you start to wear your pick down. I would just kill these things. Um, so anyways, um, that's Mean Machine. Uh, there it is, number seven on Sugar Ray In Order. Had a lot of fun playing it. If you stop by and listen to this whole thing, God bless you and thank you. I am grateful for you uh, listening to any of this and following along, it's kind of fun. To play these songs and look back at the journey the song had being written, coming up with it, then recording it, and then going and playing it live. So. Mean Machine, uh, a song that brought us a lot of joy and um, 
It was really fun to play. So thanks for listening and stopping by. Bye.